180. Ian, congratulations as debuts go in Championship League. That's as good as it can get. Can't get any better, can I? <laughs> it was an amazing day for you. I mean, you only made the playoffs by one leg. Um, you had to sit and wait while Gary Anderson was playing and yeah. he had to lose by a certain scoreline and I think he missed the ball there to, to keep himself in it. Oh, yeah. I was a Colin Lloyd fan at the time. <laughs> but, yeah, to just, he missed that ball and then uh, I think he, he lost 6-4, was it? Yeah. So um, that put me through by one leg. So I was... Uh, I was quite happy with that. In many ways, you, you didn't have anything to lose from that point. No, no, just just take each one at a time because you know I was I was dead and buried, and then uh, got my chance and, and took my chance. To come here on on the on the first day and actually win it was probably beyond your wildest dreams. Well, without a doubt, we we, we were looking to come back next Tuesday. <laughs> but, um, we don't have to book the hotels now. We can probably go home for a couple of days. Mm. How hard did you find it? Because you've, you've played nine days throughout the day, which is, is probably the most starts you would ever have played as a professional. Yeah, yeah, it was, um, it was pretty hard, um, and the standard is quite high as well. You know, you're only throwing nine darts and not getting another throw. Some pretty special performances in there, especially the, the semi-final and the final there. Oh, definitely. Uh, a couple of good finishes there. That nice ball at the end just helped me. But with Paul Nicholson, I had to just keep power scoring. I uh, ate a few 180s and Paul was trying to hit me back and he, he just couldn't do it. The final was always going to be pretty tight. It was, I think, only ever going to be one break between you that had settled it and it finally, finally dropped to you at the end. I think, I think when I won the ball, um, I thought to myself that I'll... Try, just try and hold your throws, hold your throws, he's got to break you. And then when I got a chance to break him and I took it, um, I just didn't want him to break me straight away. <laughs> you're obviously having a pretty good time of it at the minute. You, you won your first ranking title last month and, and now you're in the winners group and you look at the company alongside you in you know, Phil Taylor, Andy Hamilton, Wes Newton, Terry Jenkins. It's pretty yes. special. Oh, it's very special. Um, last year I had a lot of finals and lost them. And I learned on that this year. Um, all right, I've only had one final, but I've had a win. Uh, and now I'm in the final of the, the uh, championship dart. It gives you a chance next week to, to show that you really belong in that company as well. Yes, it does, yeah. yeah. It, 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 I, I can wave to uh, Adrian Lewis now, but back at home. <laughs> <laughs> does that make you Stokes number three? <laughs> yeah, I'll be texting him and telling him. <laughs> <laughs> well done. And of course, there's, there's Killani coming up this weekend, yes. so it's a great boost, boost for you going into that. Oh, definitely. That's another pro tour. I need to try and get in that top 16. Um, that's my aim towards the end of the year. Um, but this is a bonus. Well done. We'll see you next Thursday. Thank you.